What's up guys, we're out on the water today and I wanna to talk about how to stop missing frogfish, okay? Everybody struggles with it. It's something that everybody in the industry has dealt with at some point or another in their lives. And there's one key thing that you can do to actually stop missing frogfish. There are gonna be fish that miss it, don't get me wrong. Like, not every fish is gonna come up and absolutely choke it. But people are always like, oh, I don't think I waited long enough and this and that. Well, those fish suck it down before you even see the splash for the most part, especially if it's a big fish. So that's kind of BS. What happens a lot of times is the fish misses your frog and that's why you think you missed it. But an easy way to do that, to stop missing that, is go to a white frog, okay? Most of the times those fish can't tell the difference anyway, especially if it's going over grass or anything like that. Like a lot of times that silhouette looks exactly the same. But what you can do is when you see the color disappear, that's when you set the hook. So when you see the white vanish, set the hook and that's how you will stop missing fish because you'll know they have it or know they don't have it.